Hello everybody, I will start from where I left over in the previous tutorial. Uh, we installed uh, VirtualBox in Debian and now we are going to install operating system within our VirtualBox uh, which is also will be Debian. Uh, so let's get started and first off just click new and type in the name of your uh, desired operating system. I will just type Debian and the type is Linux and version Debian 64 in my case. I will click next. Uh, I will set default memory size. Click next and then create virtual hard drive now. And the hard drive type is VDI. It is dynamically allocated. And I will set the size of 5 gigabytes because I have limited space on my laptop uh, but you can set uh, any size you wish and click create and now let's set up some settings I will choose settings and then network and I want to change it to Bridget adapter and I will select WLAN but in your case it can be th0 depending on how you connect to the internet and then select adapter type uh, depending on what you have and allow VMs and then click OK and the next setting that we need to fix is in storage and then click on the uh, CD disk icon and on the right side uh, there is another CD icon click on it and then uh, choose a virtual disk file uh, I have already downloaded uh, ISO uh, which is Debian 8.1 XFCE and click open click OK and now we are ready to boot it uh, just click start and uh, when you click your mouse uh, in your uh, within your virtual box machine uh, it will capture it and to release uh, you can just uh, hit your right control which is default host button and uh, you can get control over your mouse again uh, next I will click install and the first question is about language I will choose English United States American English and from time to time I'm going to pause my video just uh, to save time Now it is asking me about hostname for the system. I will just leave it as default and no domain name. And I will type my root password. And then my user will be Sergey. And repeat it again. And also password for the user. And my time zone will be Eastern. and I will pause again and now we need to choose partitioning method uh, I will just uh, use entire disk because it doesn't really matter for the virtual machine and I will say all files in one partition click OK and then finish and write changes to disk by default it says no uh, to the question do you want to write changes I will say yes This time it is asking me if I want to use a network mirror. I will say no because we can configure it later. Uh, 
now we need to choose software to install uh, I will check desktop environment XFCE and standard utilities so that we will have nice and neat GUI and then I will click continue it is asking me uh, if I want to install grab bootloader in the master boot record I will say yes and I will choose my device which is the only one SDA uh, now our installation is complete and uh, I will click continue to reboot the system now our newly installed operating system is up and running and I can log in using my password and as you might notice uh, there is some problem with uh, resizing uh, the window if I'm resizing it only uh, margins uh, increase in part not the window itself and I'm going to show you in the next video how to fix that uh, we are going to install VirtualBox guest additions. I thank you for watching this video and I hope to see you next time.